Dude. Love it. Another rack. The world is ending. I got Dexter a new bed. His old one was falling apart, so it was time for an upgrade. This is from Amazon from the brand Friends Forever. Already biting the new blanket. They didn't have a medium size. They only had like a small one or a large one. So I had to buy him this monster. It's literally more comfortable than our bed. Do you think you're spoiled enough? Perks of being an only child. found who has been digging holes in my front yard and look at this and this one over here is trying to escape all stealth <laughs> it wasn't me So, I bought these little saucers for underneath my pots outside because every time I would water the plants, it would kind of just drain all over the floor. And since our floor is so light, it would stain it. But as you can see, it just collects water. So I bought one of these things <laughs> to be able to drain the water every time it gets full because A, bougainvilleas don't like that much water and B, that is just asking for mosquito breeding that's disgusting amount of toilet paper that I'm gonna use in order to conserve it because I only have like two rolls left and once I run out I'm not gonna be able to find any because everyone in my town thinks that they're preparing for some kind of apocalypse and the best way to stock up for that apocalypse is to buy a lifetime supply of toilet paper I don't even know like how much footage I have of this vlog but I wanted to take this time to sit down and speak to the camera because I feel like I haven't sat down and talked to you guys in a long time aside from like my sit down videos and stuff like you know like in a vlog so updates um since last vlog the world is ending <laughs> aside from that i don't know what else to update you guys on i was ready for 2019 to be over so badly and uh <laughs> And now I'm just like, wow, I really took last year for granted. 
just trying to stay healthy and trying to drink my vitamins and just I don't know what else to say it's it's bad <laughs> it's though it's like I don't even I don't know it's bad for today I have to go drop off some Poshmark orders when I get back I actually want to shampoo my couch because it is disgusting I know that things look beautiful on Instagram and beautiful like in videos and stuff and obviously you know I'm not gonna take pictures of all the stains on my couch but it's bad so I bought a machine to shampoo my couch on Amazon which I've had for like three months already and I think I'm finally gonna do it today I also want to today show you guys what I did I got another rack because I'm just running out of space in this house all he does is sleep but yes so I'm finally going to spot clean or just fully clean my couch just so that you guys see some of the stains that I've tried removing. It's sort of just left kind of like oil marks and this would be Roger leaving chocolate stains all over the couch. It's like I have a child. So I'm just gonna clean the majority of the couch. And yeah, we just got a bunch of stains everywhere, so. Let's do this. Everything we took out That's disgusting Hey guys, if I look like death is because I have not done anything today <laughs> Today is our 10 year anniversary Roger and I we were supposed to go out to dinner and stuff, but due to the coronavirus We just decided to stay home. I'm gonna show you guys my outfit that I've been wearing the entire day this t-shirt from Aritzia. These sweatpants are also from Aritzia. Wow, I didn't even plan this, but yeah. And uh, I was wearing my Birkenstocks, but I took them off because we've just been watching TV. What's up? We're very bored. Therefore, damn it, this is it? Oh, this is unfortunate. This is very, very unfortunate. Oh! Oh, man. This is not the good stuff, though. Darn it. And it's probably gonna taste like crap because it's been opened. Ah! Fail. So I just tweeted about how it's so cool how Italians are uniting and singing together off their balconies and stuff and how if I tried to do that my neighbor would just call the cops on me and I posted it on my story and a bunch of people are like reacting to it and sending me DMs and reposting it on their story and stuff and I guarantee that half of those people think I'm kidding <laughs> but I'm not. My neighbors will call the cops on me if my TV is like too loud or something. So I really can't even imagine that kind of unity if I try to sing out my window. They'll probably throw something at me. Last time I left the house was like 
two or three days ago i don't even know i'm losing track already also really quickly if you guys have a roomba but you don't have weights at your house and you need to um work out shoulders right here just a couple of these just improvise pretty soon i'll be lifting up my dining room table dexter's wondering what the hell i'm doing He's really concerned right now. <laughs> Mom, why are you picking up the enemy? Why are you touching the enemy? So stinking cute, can't even deal. The best part is that once you're done working out with it, it can clean your floor. So I wanted to show you some makeup that I've been using and it has kind of been my go-to lately and I'm obsessed. Let me clean. So I've been using the Glossier Skywash. So far my favorite like wearable color is Pebble, which is kind of like a mauve ashy rose color. I have a little bit already. I do like two or three coats and it kind of gives this really pretty like cool toned wash and i don't know why but i always sort of stayed away from cool tones for some reason but i actually really like how it looks i think it works for my skin tone so i've sort of switched to more cool toned makeup especially when i wear this color i match my lips which i'll show you what i use on my lips and i also match my cheeks a little bit Let me zoom you in this color kind of takes a little bit to build up. Hey, before I put my faux wing and stuff, I, I just look a little dead. Also, I have to film today, and even though they just mowed the grass like the other day, they're mowing again, guys, because Jamari is going to film today. So we need to make as much noise as possible. And you know what? It's fine. Dexter, please. And then this guy hates it when they mow the grass. He can't stand the sound of a lawnmower, so that's what I get. That's what I get every five minutes of me filming. Uh, so you could just imagine how many times I have to just stop talking and then re-say my sentence. But you know what? Things could be worse. Like, uh, you know, being quarantined for a virus. It already is that bad. Please excuse my dog. There's not much I can do. You know, I'm tired of screaming. I don't want to scream. I don't want to raise my blood pressure. But um, I know that I make a lot of jokes, like I put up a lot of stories and like I'll tweet a couple things here and there, like just joking about the virus, but that's just my sense of humor. I never mean to like belittle what's going on at all. It's just that in times of crisis, you have to find like, you know, the humor and everything. And you always have to think this too shall pass, you know? Otherwise, you might go crazy. <laughs> So that's just how I deal with most situations. I make jokes about it and, you know, I laugh about it and stuff, but I know that it's a very serious matter. Can't stand my hair right now. I have to scrunch out the crunch and it just looks like, I don't, I don't know. It looks like I don't own a mirror. I know that this vlog has a lot of talking in it, me just talking to the camera and ranting half the time and i do apologize for that because i know nobody wants to see that but guys i'm really not doing much nowadays uh, so this is this is what we're getting so for blush just to get like a very monochromatic look throughout my face i'm wearing this blush which is blush please it's the glow play blush by mac and i also have this same blush in so natural which is more of like an orangey peachy shade which this is actually my favorite shade ever for blush but i've been dabbling into cool tones lately even though this isn't that much of a cool tone but i think that it, it also looks very good i don't know if it's my current skin color right now 
I don't know what it is, but I think it works. So you only need a little bit of this blush because it goes a long way. And then for my highlight, I've been wearing Devotion by Laura Mercier. It's their face illuminator, and it kind of gives like a very opulent, also sort of cool toned color, which is almost the same shade as the eyeshadow that I put on. And my lids, they will crease throughout the day. They're not super oily, but they will crease. And I haven't had a problem with these at all. And then for lips, I get the NYX or NYX Pale Pink uh, Lip Liner. And I top it with Ash Rose by M Cosmetics, which is kind of like the same, sort of the same color as the eyeshadow. And for mascara, I've been using the Glossier Lash Slick. So I don't know if you guys can see very good, but this has been my go-to look, very cool toned, and I've been very into it. So yeah, now I'm gonna film, then I have to edit a little, and I think my parents are gonna come later, which I think they they got me a, a birthday present, early birthday present, something for the backyard, which I'm pretty excited about, which you guys will see. So my parents just brought me my birthday present. <laughs> a swinging chair. I'm very much ready for quarantine now. I don't know exactly if I'm gonna leave it there, but love it. So I realized that I forgot to give you guys an update after I cleaned my couch. So as you can see, I mean, there's pilling, which I have to go over with the little pill remover. Those I couldn't take out. But you can't really see them that much. For the most part, it did a pretty good job. Hey. Can you even see me? Not working. The sun right now, it just... <sighs> Finally found who has been digging holes. Can't even see what I'm doing. It's pointless. Do you like in your bed? Mm. Okay, so that's what I this camera just pisses me off sometimes. So I'm trying to conserve. Mm -hmm. 